The hurricane hunter's job is to fly into a storm and collect data to transmit back to the National Hurricane Center. NBC 15's Kelly Foster tells us their tools go well beyond the weather instruments they use on their missions. During hurricane season, the hurricane hunters play a vital role. These days, they get information to the National Hurricane Center much faster. We've got newer aircraft, newer technology. It's more efficient. They can fly higher and faster than the older aircraft. While technology continues to advance, the hurricane hunters rely on new school C-130s to get them through their mission. There's some technology out there that are working on with drones, smaller drones and things like that, but they just cannot handle the turbulence like the C-130 Hercules can. Besides the stability of the aircraft, it's the human trained eyes of the meteorologist getting an up close view of the storm that provides key information. And then they still do things old school. They'll look out the window because they are trained meteorologists because the National Hurricane Center wants to know what exactly does it look like on the inside of the storm. I mean, they can see the view from satellite, but you know, having a set of eyes inside the storm is worth a lot. The flight meteorologists on board say the information they relay back to the National Hurricane Center is irreplaceable. They can tell you, hey, is it a closed eye wall? Is it starting to collapse on which quadrant? Things like that. Can they see the surface? What does the surface look like? All of that information goes into that vortex data message. And it's that vortex data message that proves invaluable when it comes to providing the most accurate forecast by the National Hurricane Center. Kelly Foster, NBC 15 News. From the manned aircrafts to the instruments they use and their eyes on the storm, the hurricane hunters out of Biloxi, Mississippi are showing no signs of slowing down.